IBF superflyweight champion Jerwin Ankaja said yesterday he didn't pull his punches against countryman Jonas Sultan and settled for a win on points in retaining his crown at the Save Mart Center in Fresno over the weekend because going for a knockout was a risky proposition. Sultan was unpredictable, said Ankajas in Filipino. Coach Joven, Jimenez, told me to stay away from his head. It's not that I didn't look for a knockout. Sultan's style is difficult to break down, and he kept changing tactics. Sultan has power, so I was careful not to get hit by a wild shot. A butt on Ankaja's jaw jarred him midway the fight and later produced a large swelling on the opposite side of his face. Ankaja's admitted he was buzzed by the impact. There was also a bulge on his forehead because of butts and a day later, the swelling went down to his eyes. It was Sultan's plan to disrupt Ankaja's rhythm with his unorthodox tactics. Ankaja's, however, kept his poise but avoided engaging. Former WBC light flyweight champion Rottle Mail, who watched the fight at ringside, said Sultan isn't an easy opponent because of his awkward style. His fight plan was to pressure, said Mail. He adjusted in the middle rounds and tried to do different things to confuse Jerwin. He wanted to trade straights. But Jerwin is too skilled and experienced. CompuBox stats show that Ankajas landed 234 of 773 punches for a 30. 3% connection rate compared to Sultan's 130 of 555, or 23.4%. Ankajas wasn't only more active, but also more accurate. Mail said Ankajas is now at his peak in the 115-pound division. By next year, I expect Jerwin to move up to 118, he said. He can eventually fight at 122, but maybe 126 will be too big for him. Jimenez said Ankajas will take a break of one month before returning to the gym. Jerwin needs to rest, he said. I think international matchmaker, Sean, Gibbons, and Top Rank plan to arrange two more fights for Jerwin this year. We're open to anyone. If it's a unification fight against WBA champion Khalid Yafai in England, we'll do it. We went to Belfast to fight, Jamie, Conlon so fighting in the UK is no problem. Gibbon said he's not excited about a bout against Yafai who stopped Mexico's David Carmona in the Ankaja Sultan undercard. Yafai's of spoiler, he said. I prefer Jerwin to fight, Sersikets or Rugvisai or Juan Francisco, Estrada or some of the other big names in the division. Mr. Bob, Aram, knows best when it comes to putting big fights together, 